As if anyone needed another reason to get a bunny, here's another one for you. They should a lot, but just take one little look at their bunny butts, and if it's looking like that, immediate stress reliever. Set the bunny down and start plucking. This one's a little feisty and he doesn't always like to sit still, but I promise it doesn't hurt. It's just loose fur. Look how satisfying this is. So satisfying. Sally doesn't even normally shed, so it is definitely peak shedding season right now. When you're done plucking all the loose ones, you can go in with a brush and get everything else out. Look at this. This much never comes off of Sally. Gross. Aw, Sally, you look so cute. Sally, for being such a good bunny, I'm going to give you some popsicle. Yeah, good job, Sally. Sally and Denzel are both obsessed with these Oxbow popsicles. Another one of our sweet followers sent this to them, so thank you so much. They absolutely love it. Just came in the mail today along with some willow sticks and then apple sticks. And they even got the kitties some springs and Leo and Tink are both obsessed with these as well. This is one of the only things I can give Sully that he'll try right away. He knows that this isn't poison, I guess. Now it's time for big boy Denzel. Well, it looks like a mongoose, but I was pulling some of his fur out the other day, so it's not too bad. Can you smell the treat, Denzel? Hold on. This is what I collected from Denzel, and that's with a lot of it flying off into the air because it's extra light and fluffy. Here you go, Denzel. You can keep all of that. Here's your reward. You want your popsicle? Good job. I'm going to let Denzel pick between the popsicle and a willow stick because I know he really likes willow also. You still going for the popsicle? Oh, gosh. We'll make really good use of the willow and apple sticks. I'll just hide them around and they'll eat them as they find them.